Me personally, I'm trying to develop my own little pitches and show ideas. Sometimes that can be very exhausting and time consuming. Adobe Animate's really exciting to me because it goes back to why I got into animation and into Flash, is being able to tell stories quickly. I've been building interactive experiences for a decade and a half at this point. Sometimes that's games, sometimes that's storytelling. Animate has allowed us to really leverage our designers. It lets us play faster. We can build things, we can tweak them, we can see what it looks like, and we're not investing all this time trying to code the right animation up front. We can actually see if it's gonna work and plug it in when it does. The roots of Flash are really animation. I mean, that's always been core to the tool. So kind of separating away from the platform, renaming to Animate, I think has been a really essential step. Animate CC is really your premier tool for creating animation. Whether you're an animator, whether you're doing interactive design, whether you're a gamer, all those industries allow you to create content and animate that content with the tools that they want to create with. They have custom brushes that they might have made themselves. Really flexible what you can do. So far we've been really excited about the onion skinning, being able to have color variants to show you what's coming up and what's been animating, even being able to manipulate sound in a quick way. From a feature perspective, there's really nothing like Adobe Animate. The tool's ability to target multiple platforms has definitely come in handy for us. For example, we did a project where we created these interactive stories and the main target was HTML5. But then the client came back and said, hey, we also need to be able to put these on YouTube. And so we were able to use the video export and actually wind up with these beautiful high definition videos. The most exciting thing about Adobe Animate is just how collaborative it's been between Nickelodeon, Adobe, and the animation community at large. It's sort of like the next evolution of Flash. It doesn't scrap anything that we like. It carries it over. It's still the familiar friend that a lot of us have loved for years. It's not just about making an artist faster, but it's about an artist being in the flow creatively and making something as close to your original vision, the better the outcome's going to be.